What is going on, y'all? We are back at it with some more Chernobylite. We're going to jump right back into this. Appreciate y'all for stopping by and hanging out. Please enjoy this show. Um, so in the last one, we did a resource recovery mission and got some medicine. Um, I do believe I built up the base a little bit. Um, there's only so much that we can do right now. Um, so this is kind of what we got. I just went ahead, invested in large power uh, laser cutter, which uh, I can't use just yet. Um, some of these things you're going to place down so that you can unlock other building materials, and that's literally the only thing they're used for. You have to build it so that you can build other stuff. Um, so we built the calibration for our revolver, and this is one of those things. So this one's usable, that one's not. That just lets us build basic structures. Um, ammo and um, a lathe for making weapons. All right, so oh yep, yeah, we need to get some sleep. That's right. Ariadna's uh, memory visualization headset prototype. Okay, so. Oh, yeah, that's a prototype for some kind of like uh, super ultra VR shit, except that VR is from your brain, not a game program. Uh, when in the day, your base is in bad shape, and this will decrease the morale of your companions. The fuck? What do you mean base is in a bad shape? It's fucking fine, dude. What you tripping on? There's only so much I can do right now. Motherfucker. Yes. <laughs> do you want to sleep right now? Are you sure your fucking house looks like shit? <laughs> Day two. Anybody there? No. Hey! Answer the radio for once, you cocksuckers! This is fucking important! Come on! Don't leave me standing here with my dick in my hand! <laughs> Who is this? Who is this? Are you retarded? It's your fucking landlord, scroat! By the way, how are you enjoying your stay, Mr. Kimenyuk? Mikhail. I'm in the middle of something. <laughs> Glad you like the place. <laughs> you leave it in the same pristine condition you found it. You got a real bargain, you know. But now we need to talk business. Anton and Olivier around? Anton is... He was killed. Oh, my. Uh, what a pity. Yeah, he was such a nice guy. Uh, perhaps too fucking nice. Yep. I'd bet my last cigarette that's what got him killed. I don't this think... This guy. What do you want, Mikhail? I need you to return the favor and help me wipe the NAR database. And before you start bitching about it, I know you're not that kind of scientist. I'll walk you through the whole thing. This could be my, to my benefit, besides I need allies. So, um, strategically, we're gonna have to like fucking suck it up and just deal with this guy because we, we are gonna want him on our team later. Um, he's a fucking asshole and an insensitive prick, but that's just the feeling I get. Um, I got the feeling we're not gonna get too many, too many selections on, on teammates. Um, so... I should use right, any here. opportunity I get to hurt NAR. Okay, I'll do it. That's my brave lad. Head to the building in the Duga complex. I'll be in touch. All right, building in Duga Complex. Excellent. Morning, Olivia. I overheard Olivia. your conversation with Mikhail. Don't tell me you're actually going. Mikhail is a bit off, but he's not wrong about crippling NAR. It could buy us some time. He sounds like a sociopath. Do you trust him? No, but that doesn't mean I'm not going to deal with him. We only need him because of this warehouse. Right now, he looks more like a liability than an asset. On the other hand, you might discover something important. I don't know. Nah, 
and it's too risky. You should ignore him. I think I'm going to go along on this one thing, and see how it goes. I strongly advise against that. I know his type. He probably eats his Wheaties with cocaine in the morning. Thank you for those <laughs> wise his words. Wheaties with his cocaine. <laughs> Let's table this discussion for now. Indeed, we'll table the discussion. Um, mission time. Uh, the weather in Chernobyl changes every day. The rain can mute the noises you're making, and the fog obscures the line of sight of your opponents. This can also be used to your advantage. Monitor the exclusion zone and adjust your equipment to the situation before you go on a mission. Alright, um... <coughs> Um, so let's see. The supply drop. It's got eighty eight percent on the munitions. Okay, so he seems to be more of a munitions kind of guy. He seems to have higher rates on the munitions drops. Hmm. I'd really like him to go for the the Pripyat port. At all. There's only one one day left on. I mean, both of those are food, though. So I'll have him go for that, and we're gonna go for the we're gonna go for the we're gonna go for the food. I hope everybody is having a fantastic Tuesday today. It has been a good start to the morning so far. We hit the gym. Had a great session. Came home, got annoyed like fuck by the cat who wouldn't shut up. So we cuddled with him, played with him, and now we're playing this game with you guys. Shit! Oh, shit. I can't shoot a dog. I I just can't. Look, I wouldn't be able it to isn't shoot a dog easy. Either. I get it, but these animals will die anyways, and in the meantime, they're spreading radiation everywhere. It's a mercy. I just. I can't believe this whole fucking disaster. Someone screwed up. Bad. They should have to answer for it. Let the party leaders handle all of that. We've got our own job to do. Starting having our plants, mushrooms. We need all that. Excuse me, I want to be up there. Let me up there. Thank you. It is not letting me use. It does not let me use my item though, and I don't understand why. This item, a basic mixture of slow cooked herbs, restores a small amount of health. And I hit F to use, and it doesn't use. So, I'm super confused. But that's sp supposed to be how I'm healing myself, and it doesn't work. Lighten your mood, heal your psyche. Is it a rad thing? Oh, okay, I think that's what it was. Okay, can I use this now? I can! Okay, that's what it was. Alright. Okay, sweet. And the, Okay, that's my XP bar up there. Alright, I thought that was my health. No, it makes sense. Alright, we're good. Uh, this passage requires a certain item. Try crafting it at your station at your base. Yeah, so... We are out of lockpicks, unfortunately. Alright, so there should be a clue around here. Let's see. This Kozlov uh, guy seems to be important. 
Perhaps I should meet with him and ask about Tatiana. All right, uh, you are hereby given full authority to prevent, uh, assist Professor Simonov in containing the crisis. Use whatever means necessary, including lethal force. All military assets are at your disposal. Feel free to request an additional transfer of funds to cover all expenditures and the cost of potential collateral damage. All hostiles must be neutralized at any cost. Our main facility must remain operational. Semenov's research on Chernobylite is our top priority. All other considerations are secondary. I think that's us. I think we're Igor or Semenov. There you go. The sensitivity was a little a little high for me, and I'm pretty sure I'm probably making some of y'all dizzy, so I apologize about that. <laughs> Um, I have the sensitivity up for once human when we're doing the PvP. So, what up, baby? Hey, Probably take them both out. There's two of them up there. How do you fucking hear something, dude? I mean, you want to buzz out of here before you get yourself killed. to avoid well Crazy. I'm putting the sensitivity back up. I'm sorry, guys. I was whiffing those fucking headshots because the sensitivity wasn't keeping up. No bueno. Holy crap. That was intense. Better. 
Damn, I thought we were thought we were really gonna die there. Horrible fucking shot, dude. I do not like the revolver at all. And the sad fact is, is I just remembered we had the shotgun. I'm worried about these nightmares you've been having. You should see Dr. Bruinoff again, Tanya. What's he gonna do? Prescribe more pills that make me numb? I'm sorry. I didn't want to. I love you. I know. But I'd rather suffer the demon inside me than feel like a hollow shell. I wish there was something I could do. Just promise you'll never give up on me, my love. Not my priority right now. Burn out here. This is actually my first time on this map. Definitely over this way. Simon? Who's there? Why are you loitering here? Oh, Easy. This guy. I'm just looking for some parts. What? Speak louder. I'm looking for some parts. Stop yelling. It's not safe here. Why isn't it safe? What kind of question is that? NKVD, of course. NKVD? The secret Soviet police? These bastards came around here snooping. They arrested my sister-in-law for being a kulak. And she only has two cows. Two fucking cows, goddammit. The NKVD doesn't exist anymore. You don't need to worry about them. Yes, yes. Yeshov is a piece of shit. His goons are persecuting everyone. Even decorated war heroes like myself. Duh. Oh my. Oh, he's a, oh my. You've got to speak louder, lad. My hearing is not so good anymore after some fritz threw a grenade into my bunker. Uh, <laughs> do do you have anything to trade? Perhaps some parts? Why didn't you ask sooner? Of course I do. I'll trade you junk for some bullets. I need to arm myself in case the NKVD comes back. Alright, so let's Did see what kind of gear he's really got for valuable? us. Take a look, son. Uh, let's see, so one gas mask for ten rifle bullets, uh, primitive armor for four shotgun slugs, 
We have 26 rifle bullets, but I don't know if I really want to just give him those. Uh, one primitive armor. I'll take the primitive armor. Yeah, I'm good. See you later. Alright, so Simon is over here. ambiance in this game is really really good like just the, the quiet and just pure nature sounds knowing that you know the black hunter is out there and he's hunting you plus um, we haven't seen it yet but I believe it's um, during the Chernobylite storms monsters can start like popping up and chasing you it's, it's can be pretty crazy like the human the human enemies are nothing compared to the monsters <laughs> all right so there's a dude down here and our main objective is here let's make our way over to the lake over here Stealth him out. What the fuck am I doing here, huh? I don't fucking know, dude. What are you doing here? Dude can't fucking get over the thing. So the headshot wasn't an instant kill. That no wonder. How though? That's what I want to know. How? Oh yeah, box of loot. Absolutely. Um, can I merge you with that? No. All right. So we got some primitive armor on now. Okay, got another, got another AK, very good. Alright, so we were heading this way to the docks. Or the little lake bridge thing. I like that even though you're searching for the one thing, it still highlights everything. I will need another lockpick for that. Oh, oh shit, no. what? I'm gonna eat my own shit. <laughs> what? <sighs> he said what? Ah. What the fuck? He 
said, oh no, I'm gonna eat my own shit. <laughs> what? Yo, what in the fuck? But just like instantly drained all my fucking health down. It's gotta be that green gas, dude. It's gotta be. Like I thought it was just like a fog. But it's, that's definitely gas. Well, then they're just gonna fucking leave? Just like that? We're going to let them get away. I'm leaving, I'm done. Shut up and let me take it. Right. Okay, uh, ammo check. Last mag. Same. Shit. We can't storm the village. And if more shadows come, that's shit. Alright, I'm sending the extraction code. The boys will bail us out. Snap. Do I have to take him out? Go on, get it. Skill point, that's great. Quit slowing down my game. What does this fucker get shot at? There we go. And then this guy. Oh yeah, I took shotty down gun shotgun guy down first. They won't bother you anymore. A tough guy, huh? Well done. Usually these arseholes don't venture this far because of the lurkers. Anyways, thanks. We would have dealt with them ourselves, but I guess you saved us the trouble. Ain't no worries. All right, well, peace, I guess. I got things to do over here. Come on, Igor. Them jelly rolls are slowing you down, bruh. I don't wanna hear that 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 ragged breathing, bruh. That 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 ragged breathing, bruh. I don't I I I don't wanna hear it. You need to hit the gym, bro. I mean I shouldn't really be talking. I'm 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 a sprinter myself, not a marathon runner, but <laughs> We got more gas over there. Uh, let's check the map. Secret map powers say go this way. Join me, Igor. 
I'm close. Are you? Look at me. Look at this place. I'm waiting. Please. Hurry. I would definitely mark it on the map if there was like a memory or something that we needed to grab. And there definitely is. We'll, we're going to hit that on the way back. Oh, we'll hit that one right here right now. What are we looking for? I can't bear it. How many souls ended up in pits like these? Am I one of them, nah. Igor? A skull with a bullet hole in the back of it? So this is what we were looking for, is a burn pit. Damn, yo, that's, that's messed up. So, I mean, I guess it, you gotta do what you gotta do for the group. If they're spreading around lethal radiation all over the place, I'd take a bullet. I'd take a bullet in the back of my head and let you burn my corpse. Like, I mean, I don't want to sit there and go through the... The agonizing slow death of fucking radiation sickness. No, thank you. Like, I'm good on that. Uncurable radiation sickness. Gonna die slow, horrible, painful death. Bullet, please. You know, just have the guy stand there behind me. And then, you know, me and you, we start talking 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 and then it just comes with it without without warning pause y'all get what i'm saying now i, I wouldn't want to know that it's coming oh shit Yo, that made me fucking jump. Woo. Yo, it was not, like I said, when, when, you, when you don't want to expect it, I don't want to see it coming. <laughs> oh, snap. Alright, and that was it, huh? see uh no i keep forgetting all right so basically straight ahead is our, our mission objective for the uh food drop Once again, there's here's the drop, but nobody's fucking here. with a decent haul too. A 
how we do food success success healthy stable munitions he got us some more ammunition and some plates um, normal food ration for you and a normal food ration for you isn't very comfortable it makes your companion twitchy your air quality at your base is bad slightly lowering your companion so okay bad all right, well, that's what we need to address. We need to address some air quality. Excellent. So I'll take you guys along um, for the base building. It's honestly, honestly, the keys got me going back and forth. I, I trip over the keys with the base building for this one. Um, so let's see. Uh, we need... Wait, no, we need to... Let's see, I'm already tripping over shit. Uh, da -da -da, help with crafting new items, improving your gear, and storage capacity, companion comfort. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be power supply, comeback generator, Chernobylite power generator, not power supply, air quality, there you go. Um, let's see, is the air quality, air quality is kind of crap. tools we'll put that your comfort of life in the base is way down holy shit all right um so we gotta you know igor this isn't the shittiest most rundown place i've ever bunked but it's in the top three. How about a radio it. or a plant to alleviate the gloom? Oh my gosh, did, did you not see me in the menu? I'm about to go make that shit. Like, <laughs> this guy. Alright, yeah. That You're right. Is... This place definitely, definitely needs, something. needs something. A radio or a plant would brighten the mood. Oh, yes. Yeah, I'll take plant. care of it. Sounds great. Look forward to seeing some results. I was like all up on it, dude. Like, come on now. I might bring that out. Bring that out a second one. And then we'll come out from there. Need more mushrooms. You need a mushrooms for a lot of this stuff. Someone can sit on it and catch a breath. Probably take those back now. Oh, I can't do the radio at the moment. Um, hmm. 
There you go, the gaming station. Chernobylite memory catalyst. Yo, whatever that is, it bumps quality of life. Alright, well, quality of life is gonna unfortunately be a work in progress here. Um, I do want to build one of the... Wait, no. Where's the... Uh... Anyway. That's about all we're going to be able to do on that one. Is this something that we can actually... No, that's that allows me to build all those extra crafting stations that I just had that I was looking at. So enriched, enriched adrenaline, that's going to be something I'm definitely going to want to carry around with us. Ten mushrooms, ten herbs, that's crazy. I'm definitely going to have to start farming up mushrooms and herbs for sure. Um, however, we're going to go ahead and make... So one will give us ten. There we go. So there's there's ammo for us. And then we are level two, so Damn, Olivia. This place ugly. Teach us. No plants, no radio, no nothing. Makes your base very uncomfortable, difficult to rest in, makes your companion grumpy. He's always fucking grumpy, dude. Do you think uh, you could find some time to teach me some of your <laughs> but I'll be Alright, let's see. So precision revolver inch fix twenty-five percent more damage. We'll go ahead and go with that one. Perfect. Let's do it. Follow me. Okay. Oh shit. Now focus, Igor. You Shoot only the cans, fire on my text. command. Understood? You have five bullets for five targets. Stand straight, but knees relaxed, and focus on the front sight. Make each bullet count. Ready? Fire! Stand straight with your legs spread at shoulder width. Then you bout your accuracy. Perfect score. Look at you, Professor. We'll make a gorilla fighter out I, of you. I yet. thought he was supposed to tell me to shoot each time. Oh, that's why. That's why I was waiting. I was like, oh, he's not gonna. He's, he's only gonna say shoot the one time, huh? All right. So precision, new perk learned. Excellent. I hope you're feeling more confident now. Oh, thank you. After the next mission, I promise, bro. Radio. I promise. All right. Friendly. Friendly. I'm friendly. You're friendly. He's not friendly. He's not friendly. Fuck him up. You can't do the friendly dance with me. It's kind of nice to look at, dude. You know, from from where I'm usually sitting at, I'm always seeing mountains of some kind. So like looking out in the distance and just seeing like hills and flatland I don't see a whole lot of that in my area it's pretty nice to look at anyway y'all we're gonna head to bed here and that's gonna be it for this episode appreciate y'all for joining us and hope y'all enjoyed the show